I have the Harbor Freight 2500 Badland winch. The solenoid went bad because I had it mounted in a bad spot. From the two wires from the battery, right here, diagonal from each other, into the solenoid, then it comes out the, the uh, can't really see right here. So the uh, negative, the ground goes from here, the power goes here, all the way to the winch. But power, negative, ground, whatever. That's it. Let's see it. What? Let's, uh, let's watch it work. Got to hook the uh, battery tender up. But it works perfect. Didn't have to spend 120 bucks on a new winch. So, what up? All right. So we're gonna put this. Uh, Winch, so we're gonna get this winch working by putting the, the um, solenoid on it because the solenoid broke. So it's a Badland winch from Harbor Freight, and this will be a quick intro. But basically, we got a new one of these boxes, solenoid box. I'll try to get a good, a good. Uh, I'll try to get power from the winch, ground from the winch, ground from the uh, battery, power from the battery use the file to open up these uh, holes for the um, terminals and stuff for the wires but I already it, it works I was just gonna get a video of me putting it all together and uh, let's get to it all right let's get to it I uh, filed a hole a little bit bigger for this it's the power for the switch to put on the power I'll just take it apart So there's the power. You can't really see, I don't know, but I grinded that, or excuse me, filed that, and that's the power from the battery. This is gonna have no power, so let's take that, put this to the side, and we'll undo this one. Both batteries. And then this will go. because I messed this case up obviously that did not help me needing a new one I don't even know if this is gonna fit in there no it won't so I'm gonna take a minute and try to figure out where I even want to put this thing the fun part of uh, doing this all taking this crap apart got this on Amazon with a little pack works pretty well I lose one pair of gloves and I find the other pair. All right, let's do this. So, let's put that there. So that tells it reverse or forward and this is going to give it power and then I'm actually going to swing that around and okay I hate working with electrical stuff and here we are, put this power or the ground. Like that right there. People are probably looking at me, or seeing this. Thinking I'm overreacting, but I have no idea. I have no, no idea. But whatever. All right, let's see here and there. Put that on there. Put that on there. So if I can do this, anybody can 100% do this. If you're doing this, I did know this for a fact. When you're doing mechanical stuff, um, half the time is spent looking for the parts you had right next to you. So 
that's what I'm doing. If you are not a mechanic, if you're not a mechanic and you um, are doing something mechanical, you're almost guaranteed to lose things. Or not lose things, excuse me, misplace things. And spend half your time looking for the damn part. I could actually probably tape that down right there. Got my nice Pittsburgh tools, does the job. <sighs> Nothing professional, so no need to spend money. Otherwise, I'll be like my friend having the snap on toolbox. Or excuse me, the snap-on truck. Go right to your yard. <laughs> and I definitely know that could be a problem. All right, a good problem, but could be a problem. All right, terminals cover, terminal cover. Okay. power wire from the battery this goes up through this goes to the battery power this is the uh, this this black one right here is the ground going to the battery it's connect they're both connected this is the power to the winch and this one's the ground to the winch or negative to the winch it's good to go it is good to go so we got the I'll just repeat it, so negative, positive, positive is power, and the red is right here, and the negative uh, is right there from the batteries, and then it goes to the solenoid, whatever power gets distributed, goes uh, negative, positive, out. it up but we got it I had a rat strap well that is why you wear steel toe boots wow that was completely my fault but doesn't matter because I'll wear steel toe boots all right so out, out is in, and in is out. So they are reversed. I might as well do that, but I'm really excited right now. Hell yeah. Finally. Man, this is killing me all uh, this winter. I had my friend call, come all the way up an hour to help me plow. I mean, he just wanted to use his free plow truck, so. I thought I could just, you know, switch the plugs, but that's not the case. So this is my first mechanic video, not me mechanic, right? This is my first video doing this kind of stuff. So I'm kind of learning the different camera angles. So I kind of want this to be visible. And I want the wire to go down with the other wires. I actually got to get it to go up because this is already connected. So let's do that. Okay. Ow. Okay. All right. 
perfect. Right through. Oh, if I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna set it up to do it right, because I still gotta get those. I gotta get the freaking solenoid. Extra random pieces of metal that I can use. Would you look at that? Perfect size right in a piece of metal. Let's see. One, two, that could tighten it. Come on, man. I could tighten it real good. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Look at that. That's why you keep your uh your random scrap pieces. Alright, so I'm gonna get his queen. He's gonna have to move one or the other. And then I'll be able to free you. Okay. Let's go. Okay, perfect. Awesome. Everything up now. From the drinks to the Okay. From the drinks to the winches. So let's just get this tight ish. And let's tighten these up. Um we'll get another video of me updated with all this organized this in a correct spot and this tightened and uh, yeah, thank you for watching.